Cotton blooms are appearing in fields across Mississippi now. The estimated 38% increase in planted acreage in the state this year comes at a time when the cost of producing cotton is higher than ever. Some Mississippi State University scientists worry that farmers may be forced to cut corners on their late season cotton insect management in order to save money. However, research is underway to try and prevent that from being a long-term problem. Cotton production is more expensive than ever. The technology fees for the transgenic varieties and the cost of seed treatments are only part of the equation. Input costs in general are higher, but researchers at Mississippi State University point to a couple of particular factors that have driven up the price of production. First, weed control is costing more because of increased weed resistance. And most notably, cotton insect control is taking more dollars, primarily due to the crop's number one pest, the tarnished plant bug. Last year we averaged six and a half applications, foliar applications, specifically for tarnished plant bugs, at an average application cost of $11.50 an acre. So that's adding up to around $75 an acre on average that we're spending across the Mississippi Delta just for that one insect pest. Entomologist Jeff Gore of Mississippi State University says his concern is that the higher expenses for growing cotton are largely front-loading or occurring early in the growing season. This means some producers may run out of money to make needed chemical applications later in the year, and it could negatively impact some of the decisions later in the season in terms of insect management. Gore says he thinks the answer may be to go back to a more integrated approach to insect management in cotton. Um, we're starting to look at a lot of things like planting date, uh, maturity of the different varieties. We try to go with short season varieties to try to limit some of those, in, in, some of those applications at the end of the season to um, essentially just shorten the season where we don't have to make the same number of applications. We're also looking at a lot of uh, different technologies. Much of this research on cotton production is taking place at the Delta Research and Extension Center in Stoneville, Mississippi. I'm Leighton Spann reporting.